I went dumpster diving and I'm rolling up on my bike. This dumpster, I'm just jumping right in it. It's low, but that's good. You can see what's in there. Ooh, a stick. Score right off the bat. Got a candle, French vanilla flavored. Oh, it passed the sniff test. Yes, it did. I'm taking it. I got a single shoe looking for a pair. And there's a pair in there. More sandals. Everyone's donating their summer stuff and dumping it. It's fall approaches. Oh, a Jordan for kids. That's a single. And glasses. Sunglasses. Oh, yeah. I've been rocking those. I think they're ladies, but I don't care. Look at all those books. They're worthless. Old, not cool. Ooh, a dirty SpongeBob. Real dirty. I don't really do Star Wars stuff, but this mug is huge and I like a big mug for my tea, so. Oh, cool. Free lunch in here. I'm taking those home. They actually had potatoes in them. They were good. Ah, uh, and those beans were. Dented. I don't really eat dented cans. I know I'm very picky. Sandals galore. Oh, Ralph Lauren polo, fancy. They were in bad shape though. Ooh, a lot of that kind of sandal. I guess people, actually, probably just one person was donating a bunch of their summer stuff as it's getting a little colder out now. Buying boots. Tossing the sandals, buying boots. All right, I go back to that same dumpster the next morning and took a secret route. As I drove this time, I parked my car and took the sneak attack through the woods. Yep, there's the dumper. And I'm hopping in. This is one day later. A lot more goodies in there, potential goodies. It's nice and early in this one. Oh, a way to cheat at crossword puzzles. It's a little like calculator type thing for it. I don't know what this thing is. It reminded me of a big condom and I just tossed it as soon as that popped into my head. It's disgusting. Oh, cassette tapes hidden in there. Big haul. Yeah, it's all 90s hip hop and R&B. MC Hammer. There's a Criss Cross tape in there. Paula Abdul. This French press was a little broken at the top, but I still put it in this freebie thing in my neighborhood. This tape recorder, should I have taken that? I left it behind, I don't know. Spanx, leggings, whatever. They're brand new, I'm donate, donating those. And we got Victoria's Secret. They say pink right on the butt. I think I can sell those. This is a Vegetti. I took that baby. Make some stick vegetables in there and make spaghetti out of them. Oh, it didn't rain, but this stuff was wet. I shouldn't have kept touching it. I don't know why I kept touching it. It was all wet. Someone peed on it. <laughs> oh, this thing is so cool. It's a roll up keyboard piano. I want it to work so badly, but only like half the keys work. I'm so mad. Now I have to buy one. <laughs> I was hopeful about this bag of toys, but they're all crappy. Not any old, cool ones. Oh, and this bag, I didn't open it up on camera here, but I'll open it up when I get home. Yeah, so I knew that was a solid goodie bag there. It had those sunglasses in it, which are scratched up, but they're like $40 sunglasses. Oh, this thing is an old school yardstick, like measuring thingy. Actually, it's not a yardstick. It's like six feet. Yeah, tape measure snaps into place. There's the sunglasses, they're all right. I'm gonna just wear them myself instead of selling them because they're all scratched up. Cheat, old people be cheating at crossword puzzles. Shame. If anyone knows how to fix that keyboard thing, please let me know, I really wanna fix it, but I can't. Here's a better look at some of these cassette tapes. There's the more popular, more famous ones. Color Me Bad, a band named Guy, and Boys message from the boys hmm i need to take my so i can try it out the jetty oh there were a bunch of corn holders corn on the cob holders i can't believe they threw those out 